Hey guys, Jenny Cox here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make easy mashed potato. The first ingredient you'll need is mashed potato mix, original mashed potato mix. Second thing you'll need is a cup of hot water. Don't fill it up if you don't want to make too much. Third thing you'll need is a bowl, and that's all. The instructions are to open up the mashed potato container. So we're going to open it up. As you can see, mashed potato is in it, mashed potato mix. So what you're going to want to do is pour the mashed potato mix into the bowl. You can put however much mashed potato you want to make. So I'm just putting about this much. You're going to need a spoon to mix the mashed potato. Once it's all clear and patted down, you're going to want to pour a little bit of hot water. Some by some. Don't put all in one because your mashed potato might be too watery. Pour in the water while you're mixing so the mashed potato can be yummy. As you can see, my mashed potato is starting to form up. So I'm going to put a little bit more water. Just keep adding water until your mashed potato is the consistency that you want it to be. This is how I want my mashed potato. I mostly used up all of my water. So just keep mixing until the mashed potato is soft and fluffy like this. Taste the mashed potato. If the mashed potato isn't as salty as you want it, you can add salt. But I am just going to add butter. Do not add too much butter, else your mashed potato will be soft and you can hardly eat it. And you might get nauseous from, from all that butter. So as you can see, I have the butter inside my plate, and now I'm just going to let it melt. You should not put more than this. More than... If you put more than one cube of butter, you will get nauseous from your mashed potato. As soon as the butter is finished melting, you may taste the mashed potato to see if it is salty enough. If it is not salty enough, do not add more butter. Add salt. Hope you guys enjoyed watching my video. See you later.